Well, this day started with controversial Quran burning pastor Terry Jones. Uh, it, it is on this very ground where he wants to hold his protest. And you can see thousands of people have filed in to hold Friday service services here at the Islamic Center of America. And as you can see, there is beefed up security presence. He has the right to, to protest. I, I don't uh, disagree with him, what uh, he's protesting about it. But I disagree with him about the meaning and the explanations what in Quran. The Quran never tell you to do something wrong in your life. Florida Pastor Terry Jones spent hours in Dearborn District Court on Friday. The controversial pastor had um, planned to protest outside the Islamic Center of America, and so did about a hundred other people in rally and in support of their Islamic faith. The prosecutor said that Jones' previous actions is evidence that the 5 p.m. newscast threatened peace. The main issue of the trial will be whether or not Jones' main purpose was to say or do something that would incite violence. He explicitly said the reason why he was coming, because this is the largest mosque in America that's here. Um, he said he was coming peacefully at the same time carrying a firearm. But just because he had a plan on protesting that somehow the Muslim community was going to lose his mind and there's going to be bloodshed on the streets of Dearborn, like in Afghanistan, this is something that the prosecutor put forward that there could perhaps be. You preach the gospel all the time. Would Jesus burn a Koran? Well, the Quran, as far as the Christian beliefs, as far as, as far as, as far as, as far as Christians' beliefs are, is that Islam, Islam is not a, is not the way of God. It is, it is a, as far as Christians are concerned, it's a false religion. This isn't a question of the First Amendment. This isn't a question of civil liberties. This is a question that he's a racist, and he lost today. We won. We won. Chaos erupts outside the courtroom here as Terry Jones was not able to post a $1 bond, and for that reason, he has been sent to jail. This has been a long day of, uh, of a court proceedings that have dragged throughout the day, and now throughout uh, this parking lot, you can see here of the 19th District Court in Dearborn. Uh, for now, we're in Dearborn. Andre Ash, Detroit.com.